While the debate is going on, Cleveland and federal law enforcement officers say they are ready to protect the city while demonstrations go on peacefully. Mark Namick reports. We heard from those in charge today. We did not hear a lot. Standing like centuries, city, state, federal officials saying little during an afternoon news conference about plans to protect people and property amid national unrest. What I'm suggesting, any questions from the Secret Service, I'm going to direct you to our communication center. But they pledged to let people protest peacefully while ensuring the debate is uninterrupted, saying they are mindful of what went wrong here on May 30th and in other cities around the country since. But there are a lot of things that were learned, uh, not just from May 30th, but from the subsequent uh, protest activity and other activity around the country that we have um, incorporated into our planning for this event. The Justice Center downtown, far from the debate site, but a hot spot for demonstrations. Cleveland Mayor Frank Jackson not saying much about the building or people at bars watching the baseball playoffs. We're not disclosing our security plan, but our plan is to keep the entire city safe. Officials also said today they have no plans to impose a curfew today or tomorrow unless things unravel early. 